Hello, I wanted to show you how this prototype is going. So this has been uh, two days worth of work, well, two, after, uh, two evenings after getting home from work, days of work. So about six hours, I guess. So as you can see, what we've got is an adaptive mesh system where the meshes understand what shape they need to be and adapt to that shape automatically. Um, in addition, we have a system where you can scroll to get different kinds of things. So here we can put down some walls, like so, and they work just like walls. Congratulations! But let's go ahead and put down a door here instead of a wall. All right, so now we've got a door there. Let's go ahead and put a door here. And oh, we got ledges. Let's go ahead and put some ledges. So uh, let's go ahead and make these here into ledges just for kicks. All right make these ledges too. There we are. So a ledge just lets you jump up from beneath, like that. So what else is on the menu for tonight? How about machines? When you change your mouse to empty, when you change it so you're not laying anything down, you can see the, uh, uh, the data line of any of these given locations. So for example, if we drag this one to there, and then we open this door, it opens both doors and it closes both doors. See? Moreover, these ledges, while you can't open and close them by by clicking here because they're not interactable uh, by human means, they can be retracted via computer. Like so. So now if we open this, the ledges went away. Now we can't climb anymore. So aside from the um, uh, the necessary polish we obviously need, uh, this is developing quite nicely. And as you can see, there are plenty of, uh, of concepts in motion here. And of course, you can't stand on top of the door because um, I didn't think of that. All right, well, that's it.